Good morning, Hawaii and the world. <laughs> I just could not wait until my hair was prettied up and my uh, lipstick applied perfectly to tell you this. I just got out of the water. I just got out of the ocean. And I wanted to talk about changing your life and passion. Now, I've heard a lot of stuff about, um, well, now it's starting to kind of be a backlash of, oh, don't, don't follow your passion. Just, just, in, just, um, well, there's no good answer to that, actually, because following your passion is what makes you do unreasonable things. <laughs> Risky things. Taking risks. Now, I was listening to a video this morning. YouTube is my main form of entertainment. Um, and it was saying how, and this is true, I've heard this from uh, many different sources that I trust, that your mission is more important than anything else. It's more important than even your uh, significant people in your life. Because if you, if you pretend that that mission is not important to you, then something not good happens because you have to kind of reduce yourself in some way. So I'm finding that if you put people or things or wanting people to be happy rather than following your own inner guidance for your mission. I just got out of the water. That's why my hair looks like this. Okay, so if you're just joining in, <laughs> this is why. Um, so I just want to encourage you to um, example of my own life. Um, I hadn't seen the ocean in over a year and after that accident in Thailand, thank you for the accident, I decided I wanted to live near the ocean. So I came to Hawaii with a one-way ticket and three pieces of luggage. Now, I live two miles from the beach and I can wake up early in the morning and see the sunrise at the beach. Now, when something is so important to you that you have to make it happen in your life, then other things fall into place. That's the thing. Um, I don't have it all figured out, but I do know that those core passions that you, that mean so much to you, um, hey, you got to do them. And things change. You also change your, um, what's important to you and you have to trust that and go with it. I hope I'm not with my hand over the microphone. I didn't even have my fancy microphone. I had to stop and tell you all this. So listen, um, insights come and you have to trust them because nobody else knows but you. So you can get advice and then weigh it and see what you think. Um, but you are the one that's connected to your divine purpose. So have a gorgeous day and write and tell me what you think. Um, and, you know, don't ever feel like uh, somebody else has it better than you or, um, you know, I've gotten trolls telling me, oh, you're a white girl that's privileged. And, yeah, I understand. There is, you know, there is privilege that comes with being a white blonde girl. But there's also some drawbacks, too. Like, um, I'm, I was really surprised to find out that it's generally thought a lot of people think that blondes are dumb. Well, that ain't true at this address. So, um, that's just stupid. So, you don't have to go with what people say about you. And, um, hey, go towards the light. Keep walking. Because it's there. So, I just want to encourage you. And, uh, please comment below. Tell me what you want to do that's, uh, your passion that you're holding yourself back from. Don't come up with excuses. Just do it. Love ya. Talk soon. Comments below. Hey, subscribe for more exciting change your life news. Get off your butt and do it. Kick butt.